Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Today our topic is the history of Paris. The city of Paris began in the 3rd century BC when a Celtic tribe it, called the Percy built a fortified settlement on the Lydie la seat. The Romans conquered the Paris in 52 AD and they built a town on the river Seine. The Romans called Paris Lutetia. However, Roman Paris was not a particularly large or important town. It had a population of not more than 10,000. In the late 3rd century, Paris and the surrounding region were converted to Christianity. However, by then the Roman Empire was in decline. In 486, a race called the Franks captured Paris. Under the Franks, Paris flourished. In, 18, in 845, the Viking raided Paris. The French king paid them 7,000 pounds of silver to leave. But from the 11th century onward, Paris prospered again. In the Middle Ages, Paris grew rapidly and it became one of the largest towns in Europe. Its population probably reached 2 lakh. King Philippian Augusti built a wall around Paris. He also built the Lowry Fortress. Medieval Paris was also a busy inland port with good being brought to and from its wharves along the scene. Paris was also noted for its scholars. Paris University became famous. Meanwhile, from the late 12th century onward, the most famous cathedral in Paris. The Cathedral de Notre Dame was built. However, in 1338, the 100-year war between France and England began and in 1348, Paris was devastated by the Black Death. In 1357, the mayor of Paris, Etienne Marshall, led a rebellion in Paris to try and gain more rights for Parisian merchants. However, royalist forces captured Paris in 1358 and Marcel and his followers were executed. In, in 1420, the English captured Paris. However, the French recaptured the town in 1436. Renaissance Paris Paris gradually recovered from the Hundred Years' Wars, and in 1528, King Francisco I moved his court to the town. Once again, Paris boomed. Meanwhile, in the, six, in the 16th century, the Reformation swept France. French Protestants were cruelly persecuted. The persecution reached a peak in 1572 with the set Bartolomeo de about 2,000 Protestants in Paris were murdered by Catholics. Then in 1589, King Henry was assassinated, leaving a Protestant Henry of Navarre heir to the throne of French. Many Catholics refused to accept Henry, however, and he had to fight for his throne. Yet in 1593, he converted to Catholicism, and in 1594, he entered Paris. King Henry began building great public buildings in Paris. He also built the Pont Neuf in 1607. Henry was a assassinated by Catholic fanatic in 1610, but his, but his widow built the Palais de Luxembourg. The Palais Royal was built in 1629 by Cardinal Riquillo. Building great buildings in Paris continued under Louis in the late 17th century. However, there were two sides to Paris. Alongside the splendid buildings, there were many cafes and Paris was famous for its philosophers. However, there was also a great deal of severe poverty in Paris. The poor lived in squalor. Don't forget to like my page and also subscribe me.